all right what is up everybody welcome back to yet another video of the inventory component system in unreal engine 5 that's going to be working in multiplayer um hopefully the mic will work now i'm gonna probably divide the, the video into smaller pieces and make sure it's working so i don't have to remake stuff all the time um so anyway let's just get into it and as always if you're new to the channel please like and subscribe it makes me super happy and let's go um we got some issues and we got some things we need to fix there's been an error for a long time when you pick up i figured it out i think it's when you pick up a consumable and when you put it in there you can see we are getting some issues uh, for me it's consumable for you it's other stuff as well all the items and i found the reason it's in in the inventory slot there is a error i tried fixing it up with this in the last video but that doesn't work so we're just gonna delete that and i i found the issue so in the inventory slots update function it can look like this the reason if the reason is because sometimes we get empty information here that causes error so we need to figure out where they and the reason we know it's empty information is because it's a classic accessed non error so whenever you get these access non errors it's when there's a variable you can't access in this case it's this because it's nothing and the reason is in our inventory we have these button presses right uh, and i think it's the category ones okay maybe it's not this i think this is the issue i'm not sure we'll see anyway uh, you can see that they are empty these ones we need to plug stuff in uh, but we should probably turn this into a function just so we can reuse it uh, because now we have this equipped armor equipped weapon so basically these should be empty for you equipped weapon equipped armor equipped consumables so you just from the inventory component you just get them get equipped weapon and you need to plug them in get equipped armor and plug that in and get consumable zero one so what we also need to do is because these are a bit annoying so you can see there's a lot of them so we don't want to plug this in every time so let's just make this into a function instead let's kind of see it's these buttons right Yeah, exactly. Um, so that's fine. We're just gonna take this, collapse to a function, mm, actually target this WB inventory. I'm just thinking maybe can't I just do like this I can get these copy these yeah okay we don't even need to plug them in just copy all of this actually can't you even copy the inventory I think we have this pass through because we use it on other places actually uh, so that is why So maybe, yeah, that's why we have it. Mm -mm -mm. So yeah, let's let's create a function. Let's just get all of this, get this as well, because we need this function with the inputs because we're calling it from other places also. So we're just gonna take this. No, actually, get owning player pawn. It it should be fine. Since we're calling the pawn and we're getting the component. 
it should actually be fine to just grab all of these and inside of this function instead of passing it through i think we can just do this 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 let's see if that still works Yep, everything seems to work. We're getting some errors still. Okay, but now we're getting an error here. So we, we did not get errors there at least, so that's good. Let's just remove these inputs for now. Nope, not that one. And maybe this there will pop up some errors at some place where I forgot. We'll see. Hopefully it won't. Like wherever you get errors, compile, and that should work. Uh, and this is what I mean, we're calling it from other places as well. We're calling it from the actual inventory component, but we can probably still just do this because the information is inside of the component anyway. So we don't actually need to pass that information through because we're still, as you can see, it's still working. So yeah, that's good, it's still working. This is another issue. It has to do with the item details panel. Uh, and it's another access none, you can see owning inventory so this variable when that's not set but that's fine this one we can just do and is valid for i think this was causing the error here because it gets removed from parent before this is called at a certain point uh, but now everything should, should be fine and we should not get any errors. Ta da! No errors! Very good. So we can remove these. Yeah, you probably don't even have these, but. And this is good because it's also all of a sudden a lot cleaner. We don't need to pass through all of this information if we instead just access this, access it through the player pawn here. Easier stuff. Good, good, good. All right, I'm gonna pause and uh, make sure the audio is still working and cut everything together after the video.